Welcome to my 10-part series that covers the new features of Revit 2015 Release 2. I'm counting down from 10. This is video number 9, Implementing Small Changes That Generate Big Impact. But keep in mind, the tool is only as good as the user. With the family open in the family editor, you have always had the option to load it into the project using the Load Into Project tool. This tool is available on each ribbon in the family editor. Now, there is a companion tool, Load Into Project and Close. This tool loads the family into the project and closes the family file. This new feature can help prevent several family files being open at once. Another small update is the addition of a pin and unpin icon that indicate if the element has a relationship with a host system. For example, curtain walls host grids, mullions, and panels. So when you create a curtain wall, the grids, mullions, and panels are created based on rules and are therefore pinned to the host element. When you select one of these pinned elements, the pin icon appears in the drawing area and now includes a link image next to it. You can still click the icon to unpin the element. The unpin icon also includes the link image. The pinning and unpinning processes still work the same. The update is just in the pin icons to indicate if the pinned element is linked to a host. Additionally, some interoperability has been added in Release 2. You can now access Dynamo from inside Revit, as well as use Project Salon during energy analysis. On the Add-ins ribbon, a Dynamo button is available. You can click this button to open Dynamo directly from Revit. Project Salon is a web-based management environment that allows you to create charts and configure dashboards for all of your company Revit users right inside of Green Building Studio. It essentially enables you to control how you view, analyze, and communicate the energy analysis results from Revit. Project Salon can be accessed from within Green Building Studio. You can create and manage widgets, which are analysis charts, and dashboards, which are collections of widgets. Then you can assign a dashboard to Revit and it can be used from within the Results and Compare dialog. For example, once you have ran an energy simulation, on the Analyze ribbon, in the Energy Analysis panel, click Results and Compare. Then switch to the Salon tab of the Results and Compare dialog. 